So the main physical difference when people look at Marshall is they notice that he's missing a front leg. And so what we're going to do today in terms of learning is Ms. Willenbrock and Marshall are going to speak with us about character and integrity and a number of positive things. He has a big scar on the side of his face. So he looks different, but instead of feeling bad for him, and I'll tell you what happened to him, I would love for you all to celebrate his differences and our own differences. The reason why Marshall's missing that front leg is he grew up with an animal hoarder who had way too many dogs. This woman had 82 dogs. I know, that is way too many than anyone could ever take care of. When food would arrive, all of the dogs would rush for the food. They were all so hungry. And Marshall is one of the sweeter, gentler dogs. He would never fight back. And so what happened is some of the dogs, they attacked Marshall because they wanted his share of the food too. All the other dogs in the pen um, attacked. He was an attack and the vet came and saved him. He just brought Marshall to the to Humane Society to, to help him. He died three times and then the doctor kept on saving him and saving him. Mom is letting us know that our long day of playing is over and that it's time for dinner. I have the best life today, but it hasn't always been this way. I remember clearly what it used to be like. Marshall and I, we have been in over 300 schools. He has met over 100,000 friends. Now Marshall's book, the book that I just read to you has been inspired and turned into a movie. I want you to remember something. This is a little dog who just didn't give up. This book is being read in South Korea and Africa and South America and every state. He's touching lives everywhere.